All right, guys, this is just a video on the HDP 50 um, with the brass barrel. And we got Gregor Amara's East Coast Less Lethal, uh, his new D10. And yeah, I get the two magnets, uh, two neo magnets placed up inside of here to hold the steel balls. So they don't roll back towards the bolt. Um, so far, everything I've done to this, it's uh, I haven't got any trigger jams. But I'm going to test it right now with just a 12 grand CO2. Um, yeah, so I'll get these in. <clears throat> Now it's just CO2. <clears throat> um, yeah. I got uh, also, there's no power kit in here. And right now I got no CO2 restrictor. <clears throat> All right, we're good to go. Um, <clears throat> let's get this crony on. Oh, this camera here. All right, let's see what happens here. So, two eighty eight. Seventy six. Okay, so no jam ups. That's a good thing. <clears throat> Um, yeah, I got some alloy balls here. I'm going to actually try these out, too. I don't know how many shots I'm going to get off with this, with no CO2 restrictor, but I just want to see if these cycle. So... Oh yeah, already a jam with the alloy balls. All right, so I figured that was gonna happen because they're not magnetic, so the magnetics doesn't catch those, but the steel balls seem to cycle really good. And then you can see in the last video I just done, I did a video of me, I pulled the trigger like 30 to 50 times really fast in rapid motion, so just to show that it didn't, but I wanted to see today, but actually it looks like we got a couple holes through there with CO2, wow. Let's go take a look at that. <clears throat> but all in all, it's a good test. It cycles. I'm happy. I don't use CO2 personally. I'm an HPA guy, so... Um, here's the... Yeah, we got some... We got a hole down there, definitely. Uh... I'm not sure, but I think one of these two are new also. We blew this out. And the rest are just a dense as the CO2 dropped. <clears throat> um, yeah, all in all, I'm happy with the way it cycles with the steel. So now I'm going to kick it up and check out what the HPA does. And, yeah, because... Uh, these don't get caught up in the magnet detent that I got right here. There's a magnet in front of the detent. The detent would be right about there. And the magnet's right here, one on each side. So when the steel balls come up here, it and there's a little room to go back by the bolt. So I noticed these ones here are going up. And somehow that second ball is pushing the other one back a little bit. 
And then this, the second one kind of pushes up into the breach, into the chamber a little bit. So now that sliding gate that goes across here, back and forth, whenever you pull the trigger, it's supposed to stop all these balls from going up when you shoot one ball. Um, that's getting jammed up. It's not able to go all the way over, so it locks your trigger up. And it seems that that's what it is. <clears throat> Everything I've looked at, and as many times as I tried to figure this thing out, and I got quite a few setups of it as well, but... Anyways, guys, it's working with the steel balls. Um, if you're not familiar with what I'm talking about, just go check out my last few videos based on all this stuff. I show all the mods and everything I do to it. And pretty much just troubleshoot everything. Anyways, till the next one, take care, guys, and stay safe.